is Meg, and welcome to And DIY Mac. I am here with Peyton Lee, who is the star of Disney Channel's Andy Mac. Your haircut is so cute and unique, and I feel like it's like a defining style for Disney Channel. And I think your character's been known to rock a hairband once or twice, right? Oh, I don't really remember that. Mm. Okay, you caught me. Andy loves to wear hair accessories. It's so funny because she has like a special one that goes perfectly with every outfit and I think that's so cool and I aspire to have that. Let's start it today. We'll start the collection. Let's start with the first yes. hairband. This is a figure eight headband because, well, it's all connected. It's forever Ooh. connected. It never ends. It's like an infinity scarf, but like for yeah. your head. It's like an infinity scarf. It really is. You're gonna need a couple of different colored t-shirts. Just cut two strips, one from one color t-shirt and one from the other. Make sure they're the same length. Lay them in a figure eight. Tie a knot. I like an oversized knot. Loop them around like this. There you go. Channel your inner Andy Mac. These are the next things we are gonna be making. They're these really cool barrette clips. Basically, you take some comb, barrettes, and glue cool things on. You could put so many different things on these yeah. to dress an outfit down or up. Fuzzy things, googly eyes, macaroni that hasn't been cooked yet. Uncooked macaroni. That could be cool. Custom to the outfit that you're wearing is the other cool yes. thing. Yes, um, for the macaroni shirt. For the macaroni shirt, or for, for a blue shirt, if you don't have a macaroni shirt, which is weird if you don't, but. Who doesn't have a macaroni shirt? Right? So like, who says necklaces are only for your neck? You can put it on your head. How cool is that? Okay, so first pick your favorite necklace or choker, then open up the clasps with pliers and stick a hairband in them, and then do the same to the other side so it kind of loops around like this, and voila. This one's my personal favorite because it's so, so, so quick and easy to make, but looks so cool at the same time. And then, you know, you feel like you're wearing a crown, which if you guys haven't guessed, I really, really like. After you've made such wonderful creations, the last thing is something to put your creations on. To get started, you'll need one raw wood canvas frame and some fun faux fur. Take the faux fur and cut it to match the edge of the frame. Glue it on just like that. And then for decoration, I'm gonna add some faux flowers to the edges. Add these hooks. And then I'm gonna take colorful twine and just attach it to the back like this with some tacks. And now I'm gonna pick some of these colorful clothespins and just hang them on the twine. This is so fabulous. And yeah, I just think it's such a good way to display all of your hard work and amazing creations. Yes. Do you think it's good enough for Andy? Would she have one of these? Definitely. Yes, that's the goal. <laughs> we achieved greatness. Yes, we've done it. <laughs> Do I you think, think there's something missing, though. You think there's something missing? Yeah. What is it? A hair accessory fashion show. Thank you so much for showing us all of these amazing ways to make your own hair accessories. And I can't wait to add these to my collection. Yeah, I had so much fun. You guys can catch Peyton at Andy Mac on Disney Channel, so make sure you do that. And thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, guys. Bye. I'm staying.